Inside this Dutch art studio lies a 300-year-old sleeping lion. For decades, it sat caged, off limits to the world, until now. Meet the sleeping lion. The world's largest freshwater pearl has a history as rich as its price tag. Named after its shape, the 578 carat gem is valued as high as $600,000. It's up for auction in The Hague on Thursday. You can say because I need a new car or something like that, but that's not the reason. The reason is that it is owned in a private collection. I think it's an important piece of nature and it had to be ex exhibited in a museum or an institution. Its rarity has increased as the pearl industry commercialized, the last century seeing the emergence of mass-produced cultured pearls. You know, most pearls you see today are all cultured, so in a way created by human intervention. This pearl is really formed by a mollusk, somewhere in a river or a lake, living there. The sleeping lion has changed hands over continents and class, from merchants to Russian and European royalty. It was pulled from Chinese waters in the early 1700s. Dutch merchants took it to present-day Jakarta and then on to India, where it was purchased for 50,000 florins, the modern-day equivalent of $400,000. The pearl was shipped to Amsterdam and sold in 1779. The buyer, the Empress of Russia, Catherine the Great. A jeweller working for the King of Italy then purchased it, returning it to Europe in 1865. One of the earliest accounts uh, uh, that we could find was actually present in the city archives of Amsterdam. It was a print of this pearl saying that it was called the Sleeping Lion Pearl, weighing 578 carats. And come Thursday, it may bring history into the hands of anyone with at least half a million dollars. Charlotte Ballas, Al Jazeera.